All right, hey, Shalom, Akiam. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakak, Badash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And we are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Sumo Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God's chosen people. Shalom to all the beloved brethren out there pushing this knowledge and sincerity and truth. Shalom to the few sisters and shalom to Israelite foreigners who are scattered abroad. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of who the world ignorantly called Jesus Christ, whose real name in Hebrew is Yahweh Shai. Okay. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of who the world ignorantly called God, who the world ignorantly called Jehovah, whose real name in Hebrew is Yahweh. And when you call upon the Most High and the Son, you must say Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh means he to be or he is. Bahashim means in the name. And Yahweh Shai means he delivers. Our Lord and Savior has come back to deliver the elect out, out of the nation of Israel from the destruction of modern day Babylon, aka America. I want to start off by giving all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, and Barakate Yahweh, Barakate Yahweh Shai. Brakate Yahweh Brakate Yahweh Shai at the water. Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for another blessed day. The water Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And the water Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for all you beloved brethren out there pushing this knowledge and sincerity and truth. All right, coming back, catching another lesson through the Holy Spirit on the brink of what's going on with our Hurricane Milton and how catastrophic it's going to be. And the warning has been uh, has been sent out for people to evacuate. A lot of individuals cannot evacuate. And the people who try to evacuate, everybody's taking the same route. So they're getting stuck on, on the freeways. There's reports that gasoline is running out and all kinds of stuff is going on. And certain people don't have the funds to evacuate. They just paid rent. <laughs> and the United States don't have the funds to help out. Their own citizens that's been paying has that has been paying taxes all their lives proves what man judgment is at hand judgment from Yahweh by Shemiah Washai is at hand they just got over one which you know that that Hurricane Helen was also you know it was a death toll behind that as well and they're saying this hurricane that's coming is going to be a category six and pretty much people are picking up the fact that something is is controlling these storms and the things we've been saying is coming to pass through the holy spirit geoengineering storms and various other things like that you have this one movie called geo storm which on um, esau which is the most i sword have been given great power of technological advancements to control the weather, weather patterns and create hurricanes, create earthquakes, even to cause fire to come down from heaven, what you call um, direct energy weapons. But guess who gets the glory? Guess who, who's really in charge here? The Most High, man. You people going to learn to fear Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. And yes, we got beloved brothers out there in that region and the most side will protect those beloved brothers and and reports is a lot of the brothers they're not even in the in the evacuation zones so hey all praise y'all by shimmy shah may y'all by shimmy shah protect those beloved brethren of the household of faith out there in florida area uh, the carolinas as, as well okay so we're going to start off Isaiah chapter 45, verse 4. For Jacob, my servant's sake, and Israel, my elect, I have called thee by thy name. I have surnamed thee, though thou hast not known me. All right. I am Yahweh, and there is none else. There is no God besides me. I girded thee, though thou hast not known me that they may know from the rising of the sun and from the west that there is none besides me. I am 
Yahweh, and there is none else. I form the light. I create darkness. I create. I make peace and create evil. I Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, do all these things. Okay. Into a beast, and the thing is turning into a beast, and it's heading right into another storm that could also merge and then smash right into Florida. Bizarre swirling radar anomaly anomalies uh, are also once again present here, just like we saw with Hurricane Helene. People are wondering if this hurricane is being controlled or geoengineered on purpose. We put up a poll: ninety-four percent say that this is uh, that weather can be manipulated for sure. Um, so take a look. This is the hurricane track over the last. Uh, few hours it's highly unusual for the hurricane to intensify from a category three to a four to a five within one hour and that, and that is powerful you can look up the information called the harp program and um i was one another video i saw of alex jones um and he had this one guy on and he, he mentioned this one operation they were doing i forgot the name of the operation they've been doing it, it all links up with the harp how to control the weather since um the uh, the 1960s slipped my mind because i was listening to it as i'm coming to pick up my container i should have liked that video but it all links up with who the sword esau and the most side gave him this power to do these things but all everything goes back to yahweh by shimmy i was shy okay what is this? Psalm 17. It's yes, Psalm 17 and 13. Psalm chapter 17 and 13 on down. It says, Arise, O Lord, disappoint him. Cast him down. Deliver my soul from the wicked, which is thy sword. All right? So what was Esau's blessing? The sword, the fatness of the earth, the dew of heaven things of that nature and, and throughout the years the advancement of this man's sword his technology has, has, has um, become very great and catastrophic to where only a higher power can take this man down the one that created him for his purpose on this earth to be the sword okay his blessing came from who Isaac Yatazak in the reincarnation that is Yahweh Shai. So when you make sense, we link up the scriptures with Isaiah 63 and various other scriptures. How Yahweh Shai, how Mashiach is going to trample this devil upon his return. Because this man has great power. But he's not doing anything under his own accord. You gotta you gotta realize that everything he's doing, he is controlled. Alright, all living beings on this planet. That has a soul, which the Edomites do have a soul. <laughs> they have a wicked soul, you know, is being controlled by Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. That's who you need to fear, and you hearing this word you need to repent. Okay, just because you're not in those areas doesn't mean something's not going to happen in your areas. Out here in California, we we in the earthquake zone, so an earthquake could turn into a tsunami. On the coastlines, floodings and all that crazy shit, sinkholes, mudslides, you know what I'm saying? So a lot of things could, could happen in this time frame that we're in. We're in a time of great judgment, the, the hopeful year of Jacob's trouble. From men which are thy hand, O Lord, most high controls them. From men of the world which have their portion in this life. Yep, they, they are, the earth has been given into the hands of the wicked. And whose belly thou fillest with thy hid treasure, they are full of children and leave the rest of their substances to their babes. So that, you know, the different dynasties, the Rockefeller dynasty, the Rothschild dynasty, through the years, they, they've been leaving their wealth and their knowledge to their children to continue that rulership. As for me, I will behold thy face in righteousness. I shall be satisfied when I awake with thy likeness. So the most high is awakening us. So we being satisfied with this righteous truth. 
The Most High has rose has risen us up to teach this word, and we know a hundred percent truth, both sides of the spectrum, and that's man. That that man, I just <laughs> saw one video was actually listening on the way down. Pick up this container. People are actually trapped there. So a video of an Edomite, he has like a um, mobile home, a big mobile home. And he said, this thing hit. My home is gone. And I just paid off my house. I've been, you know, I have a bunch of cats. So there's one video that looked like Ephraimite chick. Beautiful looking chick, but she doesn't have a man. So she can't leave. She's stuck. You see? So a lot of judgment is taking place, man. It's going to take place. And uh, if, if the Lord allowed this thing to continue to increase to a category six, a lot of death, man. They're telling the people out there to get permanent markers and mark their skins with a date of birth, social, whatever. And the, the main, the one was I-75, I believe. Everybody taking the same routes to get up out of there. And I saw another video. One dude was saying, man, there's so many different routes to take. They got back road, back streets. And that one particular freeway they're showing is water, water, water is covered on both sides. I'm like, God damn. You go, it goes to show, man. Wow, man. Wow, man. So, hey, that's that's your whole Bashimi outside judging, judging this place. Fear he him. All right. So this is um, Revelation chapter 6, verse 3. Um, it says, when he had opened the second seal, I heard the second beast say, come and see. And there went out another horse that was red. All right, horse represents power and power was given to him that sat there on to take peace from the earth. All right, is, is there peace in the earth right now? So this red power structure dealing with who? Esau. You go into the Greek word there for red. All right. There's Pyros. Pyros. Strong's G, 4450. Puras. 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 Thayer's lexicon, related entry. Puras. 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 Right. So when you go into the uh, the Hebrew, the Hebrew word there for red is a adamom, a adamomium. You know, with the Edomites. All right, the red people, Mosai took away their pigmentation. Okay, there went out another horse that was red, represents Esau. This is symbolic of his power structure, and power was given to him. Power was given to him from who? From from Yahweh by Shimei was shy. That sat there on to take peace from the earth, and that they should kill one another. There was given unto him a great sword. It's te technological advancements. It's direct energy weapons. It's heart program. To be able to uh, geoengineer uh, uh, fucking storms. It was an actual movie that came out called Geostorm. That's not by coincidence, man. So yeah, going back to Isaiah 45 and 7. Let's get that again. Give you a... I form the light. I create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, Yahweh, will do all these things. That's what we need to fear. And that's what we're worshiping, man. Because, man, this is about to be catastrophic as hell out here. Major, major death. Major, major judgment is, is about to transpire out here. Give no praise to Yahweh, Shimei, Shai. Shalom.